Back. can get going. Back on the hottest. Amina, you've just seen Torfin and Dalsa jump into the tubes, sliding into the unknown. There's a faint, toxic odor emanating from the pipe that they just jumped into, as well as presumably uh, shouts of alarm. You definitely mm -hmm. know that something is up, and I mean, you expect it as much. Yep. Uh, all right, guys, what's the play? Are we pulling back and going for the other tubes, or are we just rushing the chul? I don't really care either way, but we should just be on the same page. Because I think that like, what Manakai was saying, there's there's some merit to it. I kind of feel similarly, but I just don't think no, we should be tugging we, in opposite directions. We kill. Kill, kill, kill. If everyone was super high AC tank masters, then yes, we could just go through it, but we're not. And this is probably difficult terrain and slowing us down. So killing yes. through these, it just, just put everything you have into it, murder them, and then we solve the rest. Manika, do you have any strong opinions? No, I'm good with it. I mean, I'm not good at killing these things. They're just abominations, so I'll, All right. I'll support in whatever way I can. They're unholy, right? Probably cast at them. Are they unholy? They look like aberrations, which doesn't necessarily mean that they're unholy. Mm -hmm. So is this double movement to uh, to walk through this pipe or to, to crawl through it? Uh, to slide into it would be a one action. So if you move up, Spend an action to get through. Okay, so often we'll we'll get pushed out of the way. <laughs> yeah, the the ground right. in here is uh, very wet. There's a a layer of water, although it's not too deep. Like maybe, well, ankle for the taller members uh, in this party. Maybe maybe knee for the uh, small plant creature. <laughs> uh, but the ground is also very soft and wet and. Like, you, you step somewhere, it feels like it sucks you in. It's definitely a difficult terrain. Gotcha. Well, I'll, uh, so I'll move... Oh, the little ruler when you move your token is gone. Uh, uh, is it? it? It's there for it me. It is, yeah. Or, or the when you, fog it, might well, block click. it, maybe. Maybe it's the fog, yeah. Uh, maybe you have to enable it on your end, actually. It, it's a new module. If you quickly go to configure settings and mm -hmm. elevation ruler, elevation ruler, um, there should be a use token ruler, use token, token ruler that you want to check and track combo. If yeah, probably yeah. too. That should get you oh, yeah, there we go. back again. Yep. Cool. I'll uh, I'll I'll take a third action to to move, but only here. Make it use an action to come up to me. All right. Uh, actually, no, sorry, I'll go here because I want to block off both of them. Best I can. Does it seem like these things have reach? Uh, they do have very long arms. So, never mind. There we go. That's my turn. Roga. Jim Lily will, uh, I would, yeah, okay, well, I guess I, I move here. I spend an action to get through. All right. Pop out of here, and then I got one action left. Push down out of the way. Yep. With which I will tell it with one action. Um, mm -hmm. you know, I'll do a knowledge check on these things. Are they unholy? They're just like a religion thing, right? Are they just kicking killings at a purpose? Are they? Are they? Are these guys on the wrong <laughs> side of the war of souls? Uh, <laughs> are they on the list? They are decidedly uh, very neutral in that particular conflict. Okay. Aberrations uh, are not inherently evil, although they, they definitely tend towards that way, but not enough to really get the trait unholy. Yeah, they are wrong from nature's perspective, not from the divine. All right. Yeah, that's the that's reactions, though. All right. The jewel in front uh, will uh, step forward. Uh, they seem to have no problem moving in these kinds of terrains. And we'll uh, reach out a claw to attack Amina with. 39. Yeah, that'll do. We'll squeeze you for 17 and then try to grab you. All right, we'll do the snap block. Uh, 
23 against your... What is it for grapple? I should have put the, the action there. Uh, it's against get any those. of my saves. Uh, it's a, a save DCs. It's a fail. Yes. It is versus fortitude DC. Yes, that is a failure. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm a jewel. I'm a script. Go. Gonna move forward as well and try to do the same thing. That's a net 20. Ugh. Well, 40 bludgeoning damage. Ow. And it will try to grab you. Oh boy. 36 versus fortitude DC. Yep, that'll do. Then you are grabbed. Whoop. Down, sir. Hey, well, we will move up. Whoa, that is a co very complex room. Um, move up the hill. Right. Okay, as you move there, the jewel will take its attack of opportunity. Both of them will, in fact. That is just a hit. All right, and uh, the other one. Will just about hit. Yep. Well, 22 bludgeoning. Okay, uh, then I ice. Creatures on guard, attack for Mina, yes. Yep. It is, but that is a mess. Where is it? Oh, right again. Hey. That is just a hit. Snicker snack. Hey. Oh, I think, I think the animation is slightly broken. And I will Massive also uh, activate the murderers and not that I have. All right. Yes. Use. Um. So it will take. Uh, 1d6 bleed. What? Right. It is bleeding like a thick greenish blood. Right. Co coffin. Oak. He is casting a spell in here detrimental to my health. Uh, no, although I, f I forgot one important thing. Um, apologies. We're, we're just going to start doing that next round, so don't worry about it, uh, this round. But the air in here is toxic. At the start of your turn, you owe me a fortitude save. Don't do it on this turn, Toffin. I'm going to do that for everyone next turn. Okay. Well, Orphan. Going to spell strike a vision of death. Two. I don't have my spells right acro here. Do the strike normally. Yeah. Oh yes. yeah, he's off guard by the way, the jewel, because I hit him with the liberation. Okay, that would still be a miss, sadly. That's fine. It's not a crit miss, so the that will go. Because it's a save spell. Where am I looking? Give me a will save. Alright. Uh, horrible monsters famously... Oh, okay, he, he does succeed. It takes... Half? Half damage. Yes. And he is frightened one. And frightened, alright. At least that animation still works. Yep. Me. Alright. The jewel in the back. Uh, can't really get past its brethren. It's just gonna go there and angrily chitter and clack in the back. Err. I mean, uh. Okay. Go um. Here. You know what? If this one's bleeding and they're both blocking off the other one, I'm gonna actually move over and start trying to kill the one on the right. Try and. Yes. Yeah. 
one hit at least. I'll try. Oh, it always uh, roll the twenty. Nope. I think I clicked the wrong button. Uh, and to click this one. There we go. You strike and strike while still being grabbed by the other's claw. Yep. Roger. What did you say again? Uh, yes, yeah, sorry, Amina, you also owe me a photo to take. Yes, sorry about that. God. What's the, what's the, what's the actual... Yeah. Is there a button we should press, or...? Uh, I can give you one. Or should I just roll? I can just roll. It's fine, too. Select at least one token. What? Weird. Uh, a 29 is a success. Like that. that has no effect when I click it. I'm okay, cool. Below. Yeah, that's, that's apparently cool. broken. Uh, you also succeed. Yay. Good. Uh, these things attack people who get close to them, so I'm gonna summon Kankanak. Alright. We're still on him. We we're not getting the, the, the snake I, lady. I need another level for, for mm. higher level spells. It's based on my, my caster level. Where do you want us? Uh, behind Amina. There he is. He'll then immediately cast Heroism on Dancer. Alright. Uh, heroism. There you go. Good. And that's my turn. Alright, this jewel. Uh, will I take a step back and then snap its claws at uh, Dancer here? It would provoke from Armina. Not yep, a step back. Yeah. Unless you, unless you have something that provokes on a step. Nope. Uh, 35. Take 28 bludgeoning. And it will attempt to grab. 39 versus your fortitude. Uh, Is that yes. a crit? Yes. I mean, that's a crit with 20. Pretty much. 20 over right. my fortitude, so yeah. He's then at 10 you... above, right? Well, yeah, but the DC is 27. Oh, boy. Then you are restrained. Uh, this jewel still has Amina. Uh, it is going to attempt to... Uh, from its claws, basically, put Amina into its, its tentacles instead to, to suck on her. Uh, which yeah. means you are... Uh, infected by, or at least affected by its venom. Give me a fortitude save. Lovely. No. Uh, you are, however, fine. Um, it will then spend another action to uh, keep grabbing you. Okay. Which I believe means he has to roll another check. Is that how it works? Is that a sustain effect? Uh, I'm a grab. Yeah. Yeah, he'll, he'll have to target your body again. Uh, yes, is that a crit? It's not a crit on my... Oh, no, it is a crit on my fort save. Then fort you two are restrained. Oh, good. And then with its last action, it's gonna... gonna uh, is it going to squeeze you? It sort of wants to attack, attack Gankanor there while it has you grabbed. Yeah, it's going to claw at Gankanor. Oh, dare it. Critical. Takes 38. He's still young. <laughs> uh, Dancer, give me a fortitude save. Also, this guy is bleeding. Uh, why a fortitude? Because the air around here is toxic. Oh. I had my breath when I entered. Excellent. So then you have to roll me nothing. I will try. I to do remember that discussion. Yeah, because I have a bottle. Um, I want to try to get out. Okay. Then uh, give me a. Let's see. Escape. Uh, give me your choice of. What was it? Acrobatics or mm, oh, an arm acrobatics, athletics, 
or unarmed attack. That might be better. Yeah, it is. Yep. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yes, that is enough to uh, no longer be restrained. Right, I wiggle out. Uh, uh. <sighs> um, the uh, the shoe next to me there. Mm hmm. Uh, on the left, I will try to tighten it. Okay. Angrily stare at me. Pretty good at these. Very fast. That 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 is in fact a uh, crit. Hey, he's frightened too. He's very afraid. Yes, I'll try to. So you're not an easy meal after all. In for alien shul. Have five. Uh, come on. Oh, oh, oh. oh well. Take that um, Give me a fortitude save unless you two are holding your breath. I am not. Button from. Uh. Maybe. It was broken before. I don't know. Yeah, it's broken. I'll just run. Okay, great. 22 is a failure. Uh, which means you are second two, which cannot be naturally recovered while you're in the swamp. Okay. I'll put my bow for the Whispering Reeds here. Passing visions of death from. All right. The pylon, the one that's on. Yeah. Okay. All right. Safe. Yeah. Uh, that's nineteen. Right in two. It takes the damage. It is already frightened too. We should we should actually start moving to the other one because while they're both alive, it's blocking the third one, and this one's just bleeding to death passively. So. Uh, no, I think I think I think we need to nuke it. It's not actually doing any difference action economy wise, but right now if we focus on other things, this thing still dies. Like if you can spread out as much bleed as possible, then because we're kind of in a stalemate, right? But that's advantageous to us if, uh, for things that are bleeding. You just remove that and it replaces with something that isn't bleeding that right now it doesn't get to do anything. Uh, well, you say it can't do anything. It can go here and then it is in fact in range of dancer. Ah, well, never mind. I do. Claw them. Dodge. I was wondering mm. why that other one stepped back. <laughs> yeah, I thought about it, but figured this was... Uh, it'll... Very clever. Try to ignore everything go I just again. Said. No. Oh, yeah, the, the dodge doesn't remain. Okay. Uh, then you take 21 bludgeoning. It sadly has no more action left to grab you. Amina, you're still thoroughly restrained. All right. Um, I don't actually see the like strike having the move trait, but that seems really silly that it doesn't. Is that a thing I can still do? The move trait? Yeah, because re uh, the immobilized, I can't. Strike is uh, immobilized. Okay, right. so I can still... Cool. All right. Like for the for the oh. for the for the restrained the immobilized condition. Yeah. You, you cannot can't use any else, but you can't use any attack or manipulate actions. I'm assuming that reactive strike is an attack action. I would assume. No. Yeah. No, that's not what I'm talking. Wait. Where is that? Because I'm only seeing the 
You're incapable of movement. You can't use any actions that have the move trait if you're immobilized by something. Uh, da, 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 no, force, you're, you're looking yeah. at immobilized, but that is part of being restrained. Oh, gotcha. You have off guard oh, immobilized and actions? you can't attack. Oh. Okay, yeah. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Okay, um, well, I guess I'll try to um, force open. That's the athletics one, right? That's, yeah. Right. Athletics, acrobatics, or unarmed attack. Mm. That's pretty bad. Uh, that is not enough. I'll use a hero point. That okay. is not enough. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll try again. Do I have math uh, on this? Yes. Lovely. It is considered an attack action to try to escape. Just roll it and we'll subtract five. Uh, that is sadly... Oh, you already included the minus five. Then that is enough. Yes. Ooh, all right. No longer strained. It just wanted to, like, tentacle your the top of your skull, presumably, to yeah. get what's behind it. But it doesn't get it. to. I, I do hear that. I do hear what it's saying. Um, I'll set up an aid for the last one. Right. Thing needs to die. Roga. I will move over here. Just give me out of their range, but in mine. Then I am going to look to Denzer. I'm going to cast a heal spell. Let's make it a decent sized one because these things actually whittling us down a bit. So. I have 68 points. Nice. I cannot go cast mirror images. He needs to protect himself. All right. That's it. Uh, this jewel. Uh, Counter is so slippery, but he'll try again to grab him. That's a net 20. For 50 Maybe bludgeoning. He could be better and not do that. <laughs> no, he, he'll be in fear world. Uh, it will make its attempt to uh, grab Dancer significantly worse, though. Uh, 32 versus your 42. That is, yes, I uh, believe, a success. All right, that means you are grabbed. You're not restrained, you're merely grabbed. So if I can find grabbed. And then uh, he's gonna, he's gonna squeeze. Give me a uh, fortitude save. I don't know why it doesn't give me a button there and just lists the DC out loud. You succeed. You uh, actually, that's not a crit. You take half of this as bludgeoning damage. Oh, you still have the effect from <laughs> Rogue on you. And that only lasts one hit. Sadly. There you go. The other jewel will attempt to. Uh, Snip snap at Amina here. It is so afraid, but maybe it can do something. No, absolutely not. It'll try again. Ah, all right. Mm -hmm. 17 bludgeoning. Okay. And it's gonna try to grab. That's not gonna do it, though. No. Dancer, you're grappled. Also, this guy's bleeding. Uh, no longer bleeding. Does no longer just off guard, I believe. It's a crit on the aid. Oh, 
awesome, really. Um, they all killed the bad lane. One. Yep. Right. Uh, he's there. He's off guard. Uh, which means he sure is. I've done all that I can to facilitate him. You have a plus three. Three? Yep. All right. Hey. That nice. is a critical then. Wonderful. 58. The big X Ooh. appears again. Yeah. <laughs> he is on here. fire. He is on fire, yes. Uh, we will go to death. Down. Right, choosing to stay grappled. I mean, only as long as he lives, right? No, he's grappled by the one to the north. Oh. I need, yeah, I need, I need to kill him. I need to reduce the amount of attacks going out. Mm -hmm. right, that's it, and that'll do it. You slice through its carapace, yes, cutting off like insectoid, weird limbs. And the one, the one, this guy is the one that grabbed. Yes. I will glare at him angrily. <laughs> and we'll, there we look. Really should not grapple me, you know. Oh yeah, he's 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 very worried. Yes, should be. Yes, <laughs> I cred. All right, there we go. I have. And it's also of guard because I'm in contact with them. Well, I well I um. Yeah. The the gang up is is uh, the framework is very smart with gang up. It um, just works. Yes. Dolphin. I have the book out, so I will continue to do that. Jill will get another vision of death. We'll save. All right, one sec. We'll save. Uh, he barely succeeds. All right. Seventeen. Action! I will recharge my spells. Right. Up next turn and start. Um, the All second right. two just lasts here. Yes, as long as you're in the swamp, uh, you cannot get rid of it naturally. Okay. Uh, this shoe will, will, of course, move forward uh, to here and snip at Armina, which hits 18 bludgeoning. Okay. Uh, we'll attempt to grab. That will not do it. Um, what does it do then? I guess it, it'll just claw again. A bunch of map. Oh, okay. Twenty-eight. Oh boy. Yeah, just hits. Wait, sorry, uh, take that back. Um, Gankanor is being a traitor and flanking you. What? Oh, uh, what? No, yeah, you definitely shouldn't. You oh. you <laughs> were considered flanked. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, that would actually be a miss. That kind of One. fickle. <laughs> <laughs> right, Amina. All right, um, I'm going to step forward. I'm going to use Intimidation. I'm going to try and make this guy flee. So I have the uh, uh, Terrified Retreat uh, feet. All right. So I'm going to target the one on the left. Is that is behind. a success. All right. It's not a crit success, so he's scared, but he's not fleeing of me. Then we're going to attack the one on the right. Seven. Just dead. Okay, that's me. 
Rogar. Well, I um. I guess I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. Uh, looking at a dancer with a slightly smaller heel, just to be efficient here. There is 23 hit points. And then I. Uh, so, so which one is this still graveling dance? Are you? Yep. Let's see here. Oh, I just don't want to jump into its claws, you know. That's, that would be bad. I will take out take out one of my my wands of heal. Um, and again, Kanal will cast his second level heal as the second, uh, you know, two action cast on Amina. Okay. Living 24. Oh, thank you. Again, yeah, Kanal. Apology after accidentally <laughs> flanking you. Oh, whoops. Yeah. <laughs> All right, this guy will um, renew the grab on Dancer. Uh, actually, how long is he enfeebled? Is he still enfeebled? I think it's enfeebled as anyone would be, but um, let's see what, what does that mean? Uh, until the end of its next turn. So until the end, end of, of this okay. turn. So yes, he is. Uh, Thirty-five versus Fortitude is not a crit. Uh, but you are grabbed still, uh, which means he's gonna put you in his tentacles instead. I'm not sure why that has a incredible magic animation. Wow! <laughs> and then he's going to uh, eat your mind, take forty mental damage. Or maybe he didn't. He doesn't do that. <laughs> Don't choose um... violence, Jewel. You could do zero damage in whatever effect that has, or you could be enfeebled for another round and do almost no damage. All right, sure. T take no damage. He doesn't want to enfe be enfeebled at all. Don't eat his brain. Broker is finger waggling at the at the yeah. uh, uh, no, don't. You'll be judged sure. for this. Aiden <laughs> <Hayden> will remember. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Caden would need someone's brains. <laughs> hey, I grabbed. I have to strike the shul that has me grabbed. I think that is wise. Like some damage. Mm -hmm. All right. So I just double checked. Uh, they don't actually need to re roll the athletics to renew a grab. They can just do that. So I'm going to continue right. doing that going forward. Hasn't made a difference. All right. Uh, what are you gonna do to him? I am going. Betcho, betcho. Cool. Oh, what you gonna do? Ah. Ah. Hmm. Roll can't this. do much if you roll it too. No, I really can't. Oh, I'm gonna re-roll this. Hey, That's value. Nice. A bit, a bit better. Value. Hello, biscuit. Sixty. Sixty damage. Just a massive slice. Like off shoot. He just twists and slams the sword between the carapace, like into neck or something. Hmm. Soft and we. All right, uh, try to kill it again. Yes. Net 20, that'll do it. Yes. Get the fuck <laughs> out. Yeah, it like tries to tries to suckle on your on your soft elven brain, but that just gets you close enough to just go to town on it with <laughs> absolute fury. 
as the dead jewel releases you from its tentacly, te tentacle prison. Hmm. Uh, then, for my third action, I will glare angrily uh, at that jewel. Wasn't that three attacks? No, two. Uh, it was a reroll. Oh yeah, it was a reroll. Sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, I will look very angrily at that jewel holding me. Okay, have you already to try no, to demolish this? I have. This I one? have. That was me who did one, it. Once per, right. and Armina has tried, and now I try. <laughs> once per jewel. Yeah. Girl. All right. Um, that is uh, a success, not a crit. Keeping scared. I am done. All right, Tolfin. Joke. Up to the bow. Double strike. Very gentle. Vision is feared. If it's crit fails, imagine. <laughs> 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 sure, I will try and cast Vision of Death again. Yeah. We'll save. We'll save. Shoot. Just succeeds. Look like Crit failed, Jonas. <laughs> he could have. I, it's just sheep is rolling like super good on it. Yeah. I have this sheep. And. Frightened one, it's already frightened one. Well, with the action I've left, I will swap to my bow. Okay. The last jewel. It has no one grabbed. It'll take a step back and try to attack Dancer because he saw what, what Dancer does. Uh, ooh, would have been a crit, but he's too frightened. 22 bludgeoning. Then gonna attempt to grab. 27 versus Reef uh, versus Fortitude DC is no. Ew, that is actually a fun he is, no. He is he is too frightened. If he weren't so frightened. That's right. Vicious really of death. Want to hold it. Vicious of death. Dancers glaring at him. Hina's glaring at him. Now who's the monster? <laughs> you know what? He's, he's he's gonna move backwards a bit with his last action. Belong in this world, creature. I mean, uh, right. Let's uh, chase him down. Blip, 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 blip. You know what? I'm gonna get in front of him. All right. That is it. There we go, and we'll set up an aid for the last action. Broga. Uh, yeah, um, he's running away, which is excellent, and we are not even that hurt. I will move over here. I will do battlefield medicine on Dancer. He's out yes, of. Ten my wounds in this fetid swamp. Yes, <laughs> it's gonna. I mean, really, it's. I just it remove some of the leeches, and and that's yeah. a good start. <laughs> I can go. That's that. just all of them in your blood. Like a I've like a, a cement scraper. Wounds. Well, a, uh, the other way. <laughs> I've a remove some leeches or add more. Either way should help. <laughs> how how medieval are we? It is medieval times, I suppose. So yeah, leeches. Uh, do I believe it's witchdom to try, or that it's uh, you know, uh, Gunkana will move up and stab with his silver scimitar, silver rapier. Or the Yeah. Well, cool. move up. And uh, immediately get a uh, attack opportunity to the face. Hi. He has mirror images, though. Oh, it is oh. true. Uh, Most, I think it's clip an image. Yes. Let's see, any attack that arrives uh, on three, uh, one and four. Oof. Uh, that is an Eight. image. Can, can I was hit? No. Wait. Uh... Okay, if an attack roll is a critical success and would hit one of the images, one of the images is destroyed and the attack roll becomes a success against you. Mm -hmm. So he still uh, takes 25, which is not enough to de-summon him. And he, will, he will stab with his rapier. All right. Stab. You know, in retrospect, the, the chul doesn't know why he was so worried about that guy. Yeah. Dancer. 
Alright. Where is one? Back your feet. I'm sure it's fine. The answer will move up. Uh, this? Question mark? Uh, yeah, sorry. Okay, plus three. All right. Damage. 20. 20 damage. Make again. That's solid four. Open. All right. Uh, I will cast Shore Strike to get rid of. <coughs> Hopefully. Like the. A fortune effect, I see. Four. Um. Yeah, recharge. Yeah. Then. Um, also, the answer made this guy off guard, but that wouldn't have made a difference for your attack now. Uh, the Chul. <laughs> How smart are these guys? Yeah, fairly smart. Rogo is doing witchcraft. Uh, it's going to turn around and attack Amiga. That's it. Mm -hmm. 17. Uh, try to grab you, which is a failure, and then just um, claw again. Not quite. Oh. Missing on a thirty. All right, Amina. Let's keep going. Yeah, that one. Thirty-one map. Set up the aid. Roga. And it's still alive. Well, I mean, you know, I'm just gonna just gonna daze him. That's something I can do. No one's critically hurt. Just gonna make him do a real save. Fails. Nice. Ah, some brain damage. And uh, then Gank and I will, uh, you know, stab him a whole bunch. Or just miss three times, but it's you know, two twice. Twice, I guess. He only has two actions. Oh, oh well, it. that's Good. that's a nat 20 for a normal success of 15. Wonderful. All right. I'm not sure why they are rolling for a hidden attacker when they are on fire and also dead. <laughs> Can I remove the ongoing damage? That's small. Uh, Dancer. Well, we uh, got him where we want him. Uh, but still, eight question mark. Yep. Coming in. Just a plus two. Alright. Oh, wait, no, they lowered the DC. Oh, it doesn't matter, you got a 20. Yeah, that would have been a 45, which I think crits a lot of things. <laughs> 44, it has one hit point left and it is on fire. <laughs> uh, we will try to just that does it the last of these alien creatures goes down and for now there's a ominous silence only broken by the strange squelching sounds of uh, well your own feet in the Muddy ground. 
various right. sounds of smaller insects or, well, creatures at least. Slight sl sloshing around of the waters. Well. Well, oh. uh, let's uh, let's crank the levers. Mm hmm. Yeah. There is threatened swamp. Looks like maybe some sort of pump that is putting the water up and then it's falling back down there, so... And... Yeah, the, the water is coming from the south and sort of drifting northwards. Okay. All right, tell me which levers you pull. Well, uh, can we do something to figure out the levers? Yeah, so uh, so certainly you could give me a crafting check. Okay. You can feel that at your leisure. Or... <laughs> right. Dolphin did it properly. Um, <laughs> both of you agree that it doesn't seem like the order of the lever matters and that you have to pull all of them. Um, Dance over thinks that this might not be the full story. Uh, these mechanisms seem to uh, enable the controls rather than being the controls. All right. Do they seem to be we just flip them all and then we have control, or do we flip them in a particular order? Uh, the order does not seem to matter. All right. Flip the switches. Yes, yeah, effectively on off. The power. All right. You flip the four switches you're currently adjacent to. They each like lock in with a with a hefty chunk. Uh, but other than that, nothing else happens. I mean, to your north, you see three more of them, as well as a uh, tunnel that continues northwards. All right. Well, chunk, chunk, chunk as we go and continue north. Ah, to your, looks like there's a some sort of yeah, To your north, yeah. you see uh, the swamp replaced by deep waters. Deep and murky. Uh-huh. Uh, to the north, at the uh, cave's well, edge, there's a small uh, outcropping uh, on which rests what looks like a wheel. Basically, like a, like a crank wheel. Uh, yeah, Harmina will point that out to everybody. Uh, okay. Unless, uh, unless you have some magic to, uh, move that remotely, that's uh, probably a me job. Um, and can do it. Worth a try. Yeah. Have the magic hand. 60 feet. Oh, one or less. Uh, the wheels seem like pretty hefty mechanisms. It's unlikely that uh, the hand will be able to do it. Okay. Well, no telling what's in the water, but I can try to take a look. Worth a shot, at least. Uh, take the seek action. All right. You take a closer peek towards and into the murky waters, but you don't see anything. Seems yeah. pretty calm. The only thing you do notice is that the, uh, the like, noxious fumes uh, that you're still breathing in as of right now mm -hmm. seem to be a lot less. In, uh, above the water in the in the smaller cave here. Okay. Um. Well, 
Yeah, I guess I'm just going to go for it. Um, so Y'all want to get into position here? Something comes, then you're ready to, to fight? And uh, I guess we could do some healing before that as well. Yep. Do uh, just take 10 minutes of healing people. Yeah. Torfin, do you mind fixing my shield? Yeah, it, it's churns. Ah, just do it. Cool. Thank you. Good points for everyone. Right. You spend 10 more minutes here. Uh, Dancer, how's your, how's your breath holding going? I have a sweet, uh, sweet bottle of air that I'm using. All right, so you occasionally sip on that. Yep. Uh, Rogue and Amina, give me a uh, fortitude save, however. And actually, Torfin as well. Uh, mostly looking for the crit fail. No. Uh, Rogue, that would be a failure, though. Yeah, you are second. Yeah. Oh, boy. Second two. It can better, but oh well. Oof. Hmm. All right, let's get this done. It looks like there might be another wheel on the right here. Um, Armina has a swim speed and is also the strongest, so she's going to just go for it. Once everyone's ready. I'm going to start with this one. Climb up here. There. There's three of them. All right. We're gonna get do crank. appear to be free. We're going to crank this one. All right. You start cranking. It does take some force, uh, but nothing mm. so much as to requiring uh, like an athletics check or anything. Okay. And um, as you do, however, you do notice the waters behind you uh, churn as something large comes to intercept. So we will go on to initiative as an enormous fish like aberration suddenly shoots out of the water. There, there's a wave of, of fear that emanates from it, a magical feeling. Can I use an athletics uh, initiative check? Yeah, that makes sense, sure. Uh, also, Torfin, since I forgot in the last battle, I believe, um, you can take your recall knowledge, uh, your free recall knowledge now, if you like. Uh, sure, be careful. <laughs> what skill? Uh, these would be aberrations, so occultism. Oh, Oh, I'll try to demoralize as well. Ah! Um, uh, he is not perturbed. <laughs> but he, I mean, see. it's the fish. Let's I always see. roll such dog shit on these rolls. Oh, he's not perturbed on me either. It was comical. <laughs> no. Uh, Tolfin, um, you aren't entirely certain. Uh, but you are definitely sure that these uh, fish-like creatures are actually fairly smart and spellcasters. Uh, but also means that they aren't that great in melee. How, how do they cast spells? They don't have lips to form words. It's true. I'm right. Oh Shut my up. god. Or <laughs> Finn, th this makes no sense. I was right. <laughs> uh, the fish-like creature, the Dufferex, shoots out of the water with an aquatic ambush, uh, almost like following you onto this little land. They do not seem mm -hmm. uh, perturbed by it, by having to move on land, as <laughs> it will try to uh, bite at you with its massive jaws. Uh, no. That is a hit. No, it's not. Uh, yeah. You don't have a reaction yet. You haven't acted yet. Oh, what? Ah, oh, rough. Yep, you, you gain your reaction at the start of your turn. Uh, uh, I believe oh, that's how, that's how it second. works. We're scouting, uh, so I actually have 40. 
Uh, I should go first. Yeah, because I have the scout. Um, oh, you should go first. Yeah, every, uh, everybody should course. have a plus one. Yeah. Um, all right. Mm. Poor sheep. I mean, the thing is, the, <laughs> now the, the thing is, it is ambushing, which is an ability it can only do if it's not yet been detected, which it hasn't. Mm. Which also means it makes sense for it to go first. Fair enough. I, I think in this case, I'm I'm gonna gonna leave it at the top here. I'm not sure how it really interacts with initiative because surprise rounds aren't a, a thing. Mm -hmm. But considering it specifically has an ability that it can use while. It hasn't been detected yet. Uh, it makes sense that it goes first. Fair enough. Um, let's see, a reaction. Um, since I don't know how exactly reactions work, let's say you do actually have your reaction, which means the attack misses. That seems like a reasonable compromise for sure. Yeah. All right. It tries to ambush you and fails. Instead, it is going to um, try again, really. Yep, it's just gonna, gonna gonna go for the backswing on this massive jaws. Nope. Ooh. And then, like, Shield it, putting it in work. It will try to like wrap around you and rake you with the weird tentacles around its fins. Uh, but also, doesn't manage to do that. Mina. Uh, on the, the start of your turn, you do feel the frightful presence of the creature. Give me a will save. Alright. Uh-oh. Famously cool good at these. This is a very cool fish. Oh, come on. Work, please. Ah. That is a failure. You are frightened too. Alright. Uh, my checks and DCs. Okay. Um, okay. Also, sorry, there's something important I forgot. It mm -hmm. missed you twice with its jaws, but its jaws are so overpowering that you take H eight damage uh, for a miss, anyways. So take sixteen piercing. Gotcha. Would the shield block uh, apply to that, or is that just a static miss damage? Um, sure. Yes. So I would just not take it at all the first time, and then take. A flat eight the second time, I think. Yep. Cool. All right. Uh, okay. Hmm. Does it seem like it can get through at everyone else here? Uh, the willingness of the fish to approach land is apparent. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, it's less about that and more like its size going through this choke yes. point here. Yes, okay. I can. All right. And we'll just focus on killing it. 36. 11 damage. Oof. And then you know what? Goodness. Let's see if it has reactive strike. For my last move, I'll... I'll, uh swan dive and uh start okay. swimming over here it sure does have attack opportunity all right that'll hit a hit 21 piercing prefer use next to it because then i can get my sneak attack sure i'll end here in the water still yep okay um the question is does that make you off guard if you're swimming? I have a swim speed, so... Oh, you have a swim speed. Never mind. Yeah. I'm going to assume that you are, in fact, able to swim pretty mm. well then. Dancer. All right. So we'll wade into the water. Uh, where does the deep water start? The water starts here, these two squares. Fish, the fish is out of reach. Uh, jump on top of the fish. If, if you attempt to jump on top of a fish, I'm gonna give you a hero point. <laughs> All right. Hit him. 
Right. Him. I will attempt to jump on top of the fish. All right. Running start. <laughs> uh, all right. Can leap. Yes. Acrobatics or athletics? <laughs> um, I mean, technically jumping is athletics, but I'll give you the acrobatics for this. Oh, there's a piece of land over here, actually. Can I jump to... Well, I, I guess that will forfeit the hero point. Yes, it would. Oh, alas. Um... Jump with the fish. I'm jumping the shark, landing on top of it, or face uh, planting. 21 is not gonna be enough. You, no. You're just gonna oh, land God. in the water. No, I can use the hero point to be bro. That's a swish oh, straight in his mouth. <laughs> oh, 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 no! What, what terribleness! No, I'll, I'll try to, I'll try to attack. I, I need to get some damage. Points are four. I know, I know. It's very tempting, but. I'm only trained in acrobatics, like I'm not that type of rogue, really, so... So, um, before you attack, give it's me a rogue. will save, as you are also in the frightful presence. Oh no. Oh no. It means you're frightened too. I will reroll that, actually. <laughs> you are frightened too. <sighs> God. Yeah, it's you being over here is making this my role. <laughs> oh, all right. Well, can I hit? Maybe. Do we believe in miracles? I believe. Yes. Yes, barely, but you do. Uh, hook the fish. Twenty three. Oh. So you do notice that despite your best attempts to try to get a hit in while the fish isn't looking your way, it has too many eyes. Oh. oh. It cannot be flanked. Well. Off guarded though. I, I see I see how it is fish. Is it it's off guarded? No, because nope. if I can't flank it then I don't get sneaky. Oh. So Armina or me need to crit. Get it into flanking. And then if I hit, I can keep it off guard because of my debilitations. But I need to keep hitting it. Or getting it off guard some other way. Often. You folks crit all the time. So. Um, <laughs> Alright. Take aim. For the strike. I'll strike the fish. What Thorfinn has seen so far, he's... Uh, if the knowledge that what he thinks about it is true, not doing very well attacking right. Yeah, uh, give me a will save. First. Sorry? Yes. The the frightful presence of these uh, aquatic aberrations is severe. Like the, these are these are not this is not a small fry. Uh, but you are perfectly fine. What hit? That is it. Nice. Oh, hold on. Is your attack roll? Why is it roll? It should be plus. Elven curve blade. There's a 32 here. It? Sheep? A 32, yes. Okay. Oh, damage. That hit. Uh. I don't think it makes a difference uh, in the current situation, but it is in water, which means aquatic uh, combat rules apply. Oh, it's a surface? Uh, for... Well, it, it's sort of. Um... Yeah, you're right. It would be mostly at the surface right now. Okay. But I, I, I do have those open in case it becomes relevant, because they can certainly dive. But right now, yes, that is a hit. I'm Okay, that's my turn. All right. Uh, Dancer, you do notice that the water to your west here starts churning as well as a second of them rushes at you with surprising speed oh boy. and will uh, ambush you. Which means you are off guard and it will uh, try to hit you with its jaws. That would be a critical. Would a dodge not make it a critical? Yes. I would I would dodge. Alright. Then you take twenty-eight. 
And in its overpowering jaws, it will attempt to grab you. 30 versus fortitude. Yes. You're grabbed. Oh, and right. then, with its third action, it's gonna swallow you. Oh. Oh, boy. I ain't reading that. <laughs> <laughs> Um, it is worse in athletics versus your reflex, so we'll see how that goes. Oh, yeah. uh, that's a crit, mm -hmm. uh, which means you are swallowed. You are grabbed one, you are slowed one, you have to hold your breath. Um, you also bottle. take uh, 24 bludgeoning and acid damage now and at the end of each of your turns. As it shoots out of the water, gra like bites you, grabs you, then just gulps you down. So, if you can, if you can hit the rupture threshold, you can cut me out of it. <laughs> At the top there of the. Yeah. If the monster takes piercing or slashing damage, equaling or exceeding the listed rupture value from a single attack or spell, the swallow creature cuts itself free. Well, that was not what I planned. Um... <laughs> I'll move here. I'll look to the one that swallowed Densa, and I will try to at least make it soft for him. And fill it up with mashed potatoes. <laughs> yeah, just put more stuff in <laughs> there with Dancer. Vomit! Get him out of there! <laughs> um, it succeeds. Mm -hmm. It's still second one. But it can vomit everything out. On as it wishes. So be it. Uh, the other one is looking at Amina still. The spell is so, so useful. Uh, and will attempt to um, yeah, just just try to eat Amina. She's in, uh, she's in the water there. Thirty six. Yeah. That hits. 30 piercing. Yeah, oh, block. We'll attempt to grab you. 29 is not going to do it, I don't think. Nope. And then uh, try to bite again. That is a crit miss, so no damage. All right. Uh, it is also still bleeding. Wonderful. No longer bleeding. I mean, no, your turn. All right. I want to swim up to this fish. And okay. then can I use an athletics uh, first, check to... Hmm? Both, both of them are going to take their attacks of opportunity. Is it for just uh, moving within their threatened range? Or into there? They have attack of opportunity. You are using a move action. Um, move action, yeah. Okay. That, that is That is how that works. Okay, I could just step here then. Uh, you can't step while swimming. Okay, never mind. Then eh? mm, At least I... Uh, you can't step using a speed other than your land speed. Yep. Uh, which means they will attempt to attack you. That's a miss. Take... Mm -hmm. uh, Eight. Eight piercing. And the other one. That's a net 20. Oof. Take 50 piercing. I'm glad I saved the block. Fighting over Amina. Oh, why is it? It went straight into its mouth, it seems. Yes, you're, you're under the fish. Yep, that's, the, um, that's not, uh, not an accident. All right, you're, you're uh, diving down under the fish. No, I, w I want to uh, get in that fish mouth and then uh, use an athletics check, if I may, to either grab Dancer's wrist uh, and try to pull him out or just to grab onto the fish uvula and make it throw up. Um, I would let you use athletics to assist Dancer okay. as an A check. All right. Uh, 
Sounds good. 39. Okay. That is a crit. On the on the eight foot hunter when he tries to escape. Yep. Uh and then I guess I have another action left, so I'll just hack away at it. No. That is a miss. Uh dancer. You are swallowed by an enormous alien fish. I want to get out. All right, you can do an escape. Can I cut myself out? You can attack while within the creature. It would be considered off guard, but you can only use unarmed attacks or attacks with weapons that are considered light. Mm. As in uh, light bulk. That's I don't think my pearl blade is. Um, okay, well, hmm. I guess I'll try to uh, get out of the fish. Um, okay. Plus three. Plus three. It is versus its fortitude DC. Yeah. So I forgot my plus six. So that should have been a 45. A 30. Uh, that is out. not enough. Oh boy. Then my chances of getting out are not worse. Uh, I mean, I might roll a 20, I suppose. Nope. Oh, I mean, it half of a 20, a 2. Um, is there any other action I can do? Did you check it out? Uh, <laughs> well, you are uh, grabbed and slowed one, so you only have two actions in the first place. But you can basically take any action that you can take while being grabbed. You just can't see any other targets, uh, any other locations, basically. Oh, I was me then. Okay, at the end of your turn, you take 27 bludgeoning and acid. I will be probably down next turn. Get out. Well, I mean, I can try to... I think I just read it, so I don't think this actually requires... I mean, you're within 15, so is it. You're taking damage. It should stop its digestion system. I mean, it should stop being and such a bad fish. Enemy damages your allies, and both are within 15 feet of you. I mean, technically. You know, digesting sentient creatures isn't nice. You should stop it. Um, sure, take, take no damage. All right. <laughs> Somehow the Power juices flow fish. away. <laughs> yeah. It it doesn't make a lot of sense, but this ability is very vague in the first place. Do you want it's... to go to hell, fish? I, I, you could be redeemed, like... you could be better. I will say it is my favorite ability of this entire campaign. <laughs> <laughs> it is very powerful. It's the uh, shaming people power. Uh, yeah. Often. You you shame like the abomination. The gut juices of a fish. Of, of an alien you fish. Do this. What would your mother say? Oh, jeez. Often. So, I want to rupture this thing. I have to do 23 damage in one attack. Uh, 23 piercing or slashing damage in one attack or spell. I think I can do that. And try. I crit. Uh, Alright, well. Do I have line of sight of it, where I am? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, as for compression, plus right back. Yeah, but, but I, I do think that since every target now is in the water, basically, uh, aquatic rules do apply. For ranged weapons that deal piercing damage, that just means that your range increment is halved and you're close enough for that not to matter. Okay. But isn't fire damage halved? Uh, they gain resistance 5. Yeah, so I should not pick flame. Frost? Shock? Or yeah. Shocks? Okay. We'll see if I hit. If I hit Dancer. Who's the fish? Uh, hero fish. point. Huh. Hit. Hmm. <laughs> That's just my life. Okay. 
six and a three. Uh, this fish. I mean, I'm sort of sitting in its jaws, which is very much an invitation as far as it is concerned. Mm -hmm. Um, so it will uh, bite. I mean, no. oh, good. That is a crit. Goodbye, Al. Can you block? That would make that a normal hit. I've already used my block this turn. Wait then a sec. Cannot. Wait, wait, wait. No, I gain an extra reaction that I can use, so I can use my regular reaction to do that. I'm not used to having multiple reactions. Yes, I can block. Alright. Then that would only be a normal hit. For 32. Oof. Which is still enough to do down Amina. Yep. Uh, oh, because the shield was broken. Hmm. So... Would have only provided a plus... That would still have done it, even with a plus one. It just didn't... I couldn't reduce it further. Um. So yeah, I take 32 damage. All right. The fish is then going to turn around and look at Roga. Fish. And we'll uh, strike him with jaws. No. No. Crit. I'm I'm rolling oh, horribly well. I'm so sorry. Take sixty-five Why? piercing damage. Okay. Uh, that... Wait, oh, sorry. That I didn't. I, I didn't. I didn't roll it with map. Fish. <laughs> I, I didn't. I didn't. Yes, it does. I didn't roll that with map, which means that's only a normal hit. Take uh, take mm. half of that. Actually, no, less than half because that was deadly. I'm just gonna roll the damage again. Take thirty-one instead. Okay. Just gonna. Undo. We go. Oh boy. Still hurts. And then it will try to uh, grab you. It really shouldn't. 28 versus fortitude. That looks like a success. Yeah. Consider yourself grabbed. Oh, damn it. Is it all you, Tofin? Roger. So I can't do stuff with manipulation, right? Uh, you can, but there's a chance it may fail. It's a DC 5 flat check if you attempt to manipulate. Well, um, and how do I get out of this again? I, I do... Escape is acrobatics, athletics, or unarmed attack. All stuff that I am bad at. And the DC is its fortitude DC, yeah? Yes. I'm better off just taking the flat check. Here goes nothing. I attempt to cast my spell. Okay. Roll a d20. Plus... Well, no, plus no, just, nothing. Just... Plus nothing. Yep, that'll do Excellent. it. Excellent. I am I am unfettered. Okay, the fish will, however, take its attack opportunity. Cool. Which is a nat one. Good. That's good. That one barely missed, so he hits me on a two. Uh, well, uh, I will then spend an action to automatically escape. All right, you're free. And then I will... Leave. Uh, is that my speed? No, not quite. But going much further. I'm going to go here. Because much further away, I feel like they'll just go back onto the sea. And that would be unfortunate. I can bring someone back if they die, but only if it's like... No, I can prevent the target from dying. Within 60. Question is again about line of effect inside the monster, but you know. Uh, I'm actually not gonna. I'm just gonna go move here, probably, because I don't want them to, to escape, so. Uh, that's, that's it, though. Alright, gonna quickly move Amina to the north here. Yeah. 
She is not, in fact, in the fish. Uh, this... Uh, Diferax will look at Roger with its scintillating, glowing eyes and cast a spell. Uh, the Mariner's Curse. Give me a will save. Okay. What's the range of this? Touch? Uh, oh, it says touch. Never mind. Um... Then instead it's gonna not cast that, it's gonna cast Hypnotic Pattern instead. Hmm. Right here. Both of you give me will saves. You're automatically dazzled while you're in it. Torfin is fascinated. Uh... And then... See, I, I don't roll. think I can heal you guys while you're inside fish. So. Not do much. Amina isn't. Amina is sort of floating, I guess. Oh. Dancer, however, is certainly inside a fish. Um... Well... Would you would the fish be considered a guard to me? Yes. Okay. While you're inside, attacks would be off guard. Then against against off guard. I have one chance to get out. Use an action to pull out my rapier. Use that. Try to rupture the fish to get out that way. All right. Only thing I can think of. Can't click on that. Mm, I'm gonna move the fish. Right. Um. Uh, that. Is gone. You don't seem to have a rapier. Did you put it into the stench? I don't think so. It's not in the stash. Oh. I don't think so. Well, I guess. could punch it but that's not piercing damage um uh, let's see blow the horde of fog <laughs> to grant a lot of fog inside the, oh, the, the the damage does not have to be uh piercing to rupture it Ashings. well right. the hangars are bludgeoning hey yes but i can only use a light blade uh yeah, piercing and, and piercing or slashing work, but punching would be bludgeoning, which isn't really great to escape here. Alright, then I apparently do not have my rapier. I don't that is, but I don't have it. Well, if 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 you if you think you would have kept your rapier and just made a mistake at some point in I, the past, I think I, I, think I, I, I would, would not punish you for it. I, I think I keep the rapier for the missions, but I don't I might have sold it, but I don't know when I did that in that case, because I used it like a session ago. Maybe I can pop the feather token oh. swan boat and explode the fish from it. <laughs> I, I, would, I would make that some sort of check. <laughs> I mean, so just eat him from the inside. Yeah, exactly. He's my team. Eat him back. Eat way out. I, I gave him. you a rape here. Okay. I will, um... I will... Strike with this rapier. All right. Wear this rapier. Rapier. 
Uh, is it fair to add plus one striking to it, or just rolling the did, normal rate? Did you have a plus one striking rate? I did. Remember, I used that on. Then the... you did use that. Yeah, uh, I'll make it a plus one striking rate. There you go. Uh, all right, give it a go. Come on, rapier. Yes. It is a hit. No. Oh, oh no. Twenty. Ah, I'm poking. I'm poking. I can't. You can add extra with your debilitation. Right? It's true. I can extra with my debilitation 2d6. Extra All right. precision damage. So. If if that is more than free, that would do it. All right. Let's see. Ah. That, that, that is, in fact, more than 20 free from one attack. So it's a plunges uh, out of the fish belly. Means you cut yourself free. Uh, 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 uh. You're still in the water without a swim speed, which means you are off guard. Hmm. So there's like a, a death trap. Is that active still? A death trap? Yeah, the the scintillating colors. No, that that is a uh, hypnotic pattern, which yes, it is sustained. Uh, what do here? Um, these fish sense things in the water. They probably do. Probably have some sort of water sense. Um, all right. My last action will then to, uh, if I can, uh, cast the um, invisibility powder on myself. Try to give me just a little bit of uh, quite a slightest of use the dust of disappearance. All right. You disappear. I, I I can't. There's... Hmm? Invisible. Powder is used. Done. Done all I can. Tolfin, you are fascinated. Perception. Which means that uh, you take a minus two penalty to perception and skill checks, and you can't use concentrate actions unless they are related to the subject of your fascination. So any action with the concentrate trait has to be related to this hypnotic pattern. So I can't cast spells, other than like yes. dispelling a object. Correct. Can I walk out of it? Uh, you can. Does it immediately end it? Um... Creature currently doesn't attempt new saves. Uh, I think you stay fascinated. The condition ends if a creature uses hostile actions against you or any of your allies. Okay, so you're just fascinated for as long as you don't see a hostile action occurring. Against me or... Uh... Against anyone. Against anyone? Didn't Dancer just attack the thing? <laughs> you know? uh, a hostile action against any of your allies. Sorry. This sucks. Unless you unless you ally with the fish, you will remain fascinated. Walk out of it at least, so I'm not dazzled. Yep. Walk here instead. I can't cast. I'll just start shooting. What I can do? A bow. That is, in fact, a hit. Put minus five. Amina, you are dying. 
Give me your recovery check. Can do. All right. Uh, is there a, a button for me, or is it yes. just in my... It's... On your sheet, the dice left of your dying tracker. Ah, there it is. Success. Uh, success. All right. It's your dying zero. Does that mean anything? Yeah, reduced by one. Able but unconscious. Yes. You remain unconscious, but you can wake up as described in that condition. All Which right. means if you were now to take any damage, uh, well, you would still be at zero points. Never mind. Yeah, you're basically stable. Okay, cool. Uh, this fish, well, he will attempt to eat Dancer again. No, I am invisible. True, you are invisible. I forgot about that. That is important. Um, they do have an imprecise sense, which ah. means they know which square you're in, but ah. not exactly where you are. I I have extra sneakiness. I am taking precautions against such senses. Ah, yes, of, of course you prepared for being mm -hmm. attacked by fish, mm -hmm. um, which means he has, I guess, a vague sense that you're in that direction. Could seek, I guess. He could seek to try to identify what's going on, I suppose. Yes, he will do that. He is seeking and you are hidden. Uh, 33 against your stealth DC. Your stealth DC is 32, it looks like. If a plus 22. Which means, uh... That... Uh, wait, were you undetected or hidden? You were hidden. Which means you're now observed. And you will... Undetected. Uh, if you uh, become invisible while being observed, uh, you only become hidden until you sneak. And uh, it will then attack, which uh, oh. would barely be a hit. Oh, um, he, he, he failed his check. Missed the flat check. check yeah, but he, he just seeked to make you observed. Not make which means hit. he doesn't. That, uh, that, yeah, I'm still, uh, I'm still, he still has to beat the DC. Uh, Unless there's blind fight. So, if you use an effect like invisibility while being observed, you only reduce your state to hidden, uh, not to undetected. If you then seek a hidden creature and succeed on the seek, that reduces it from hidden to observed, which means he can target you without rolling a check. I think we've done it like that before, but... Um... Try to follow the rules pretty closely. Let's see. Or some devils, I think, that we were... Had, had like, sought and detected and whatnot. Might they, be different features it, at play here. Yeah, the, the, the important bit is moving after you've become invisible. Um, sure, but let, let's, let's, let's try to be consistent. If I've done it this way in the past, he rolled a 1 on his d d20. Even if the DC was lowered through the seek somehow, that, that would then be a miss. Um, but... He'll try again. He, you, you will at least be considered hidden, which means he has a chance to hit you. Uh, which, however, is a miss, uh, even though he succeeded on the uh, hitting you. However, uh, you still take eight piercing on a miss. I'm no longer fascinated. Uh, correct. You are no longer fascinated. Roga, uh, you are in the hypnotic pattern, which yes. um, okay. You only have to roll another save if you end your turn in the pattern. Oh, uh, do I heal dancer or Mina, guys? Ah, uh, I mean. I can hide on my turn if I survive that long. Uh, at that point, I might be difficult to by these 
Yeah, it might it might be time for us to pull back. I need to grab Armina and swim back to, you know, the less watery area so these fish can't just wiggle onto land after us. It may be worth even doing an AoE heal to get us both, even though it would heal both of them. Because we're in a bad we're in a bad spot, and if we can both move back, then a lot less it, health though. Then if that's the case, I would just heal Amina. You, you, I have that fish needs to needs to spot me, and then it needs to attack and hit. So I have some defenses. Uh, against being right, well, taken they, out. They also but don't have attacks of opportunity, so. They do. They do. They do. Oh. Well. That's what I went to find out earlier. All right, Amina. It's going to be you then. Two action what? heal. I'm not hitting that thing. Um, have some of that. Thank you. I'll move back here. Get out of the pattern. All right, then you don't need to roll the safe. That's me. The fish. I mean, there's no reason to su sustain a spell here. Um, does that help? No, that's not a good spell to use. Right, it'll not concentrate on the spell, so that's going to disappear. Instead, it will attempt to also seek a dancer. It will seek a dancer. Heal. He does not know where you are. Like, he, he doesn't even feel you in the waters anymore, which is really weird. <laughs> uh, it'll try again. Oh. No. Last time? Yes. He knows, but he has no action left. Uh, Alright, I will hide. Uh, really hide in the water. Let's see, you hide. You hide by, or deeper into concealment to become hidden rather than observed. All right. The GM rolls your stealth in secret and compares the result to the perception DC of the observing creatures. I have done so, and you succeed. Yahoo. Which means you're now hidden. Um. I need to get Armina back to land. Um. It would be difficult to land. do. It would be difficult to drag someone through water subtly. <laughs> the other option is I can certainly lay into the most hurt fish and hope to destroy. Romina got healed. How much? Sixty-nine. Um. Mm -hmm. Obligatory. Nice. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, mm. if you go full defense, you might survive the fish. Honestly, if you, like, aid a reactive strike, that would be helpful. And then I could just swim my own way back, because I'm, I'm, like, right after you. Orphan goes between us. Um, I can kill that so fish. I think we just... Yeah. I think, I think we probably inch our way back while trying to kill the fish. Like, you try to kill the fish, maybe step back. I can step into this square over here and try yeah. to kill the fish as well. Then I will spend one action. Like, oh, no, I can't step. Can't step. No, you can't. Damn it. Uh, we need to cut our way through these fish. It's the only so, way. So I'm taking one, yeah, one react strike no matter what anyway. Yeah, let's try and kill this and then we can... It makes the retreat a lot easier. You, you can pull out your glaive and poke the fish with if you don't want, like, to... <laughs> oh, I guess, but yeah, I, then you don't have your shield. Which yeah, is not no, ideal I'm, given I'm, the situation. No, I, I don't do very much damage anyway. My job is to eat, eat attacks. All right, uh, then in that case, uh, spend one action to pop back to curve blade. This. Is 
Hold. Then we will attack the fish. I am invisible and a, un, unobserved. You are hidden. Hidden. Right. Yes. I mean, it makes it off guard. I don't get anything else for that, right? Correct. Guard. All right. Then we will attempt to slash the fish. Come on, please. Yes. That is a net nice. 20. Fuck the fish. <laughs> <laughs> you heard me. No, at this point, it's warranted. You slash into the I will, fish. I will add 2d6 extra on top of it. That, uh, in an attempt to just maximize as much as I can. I did crit, so... That double two? Usually all dice. Um, that is a good question. I'll roll 2d6. Uh, well, where's that feature from exactly? Debilitating it's, strike. It is my level 10 class. Oh, the one Precise that's like they're off guard or they take. Direct 2d8 extra damage. Takes an additional 2d8, 2d6 precision. Yeah, the target damage. takes an additional 2d6 precision damage from your attacks. I assume that just adds to the sneak attack, right? Yeah, the uh, from your attacks, it would be part of your attack, so it would double. All right, so roll 2d6 and double it. Two. No. Yes. <laughs> oh. You'll take four extra damage. All right. He's also in. On fire while in the water. I mean, he's he's in the water. I don't think he can be on fire. Can he? And he's resistant. Magical he's on super fire. fire. Oh, he, he's resistant to it. Yeah. Um. Yes, that was hiding, swapping, attacking. All right, I'm done. All right, you're. Uh, well, you, you would still be hidden because uh, yes. greater invisibility. Yes. Okay. Twelve then. Try and kill this fish. Watch the fish. <laughs> hmm. Better to just shoot it. It wants. Or anything. Doesn't do anything. <laughs> that is. Yes. Yes. 19. 5. Yes. Uh-huh. Oh, 16. Minus 10. It is the fish. barely hanging in there. <laughs> Can't. Oh. No. <laughs> oh, it did so good. Yeah, I tried. So, now, Amina and Dancer, why, why don't both of you have a hero point? No, oh, thank you. Fighting to the death <laughs> in a in a murky pond, a, a representation of an alien realm from far <laughs> beyond the stars. Calling these things fish is really a enormous understatement. They're like Aboleth level of, <laughs> of bad. Damn. Amina. Okay, uh question. These guys have reach. Yes. Okay. They've tentacles, they've distending jaws. And, uh, all right. I really think I'm just going to get... I'd love to go and kill that fish, but... I'm just going to get thwacked by both of them if I move up. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to... I got a swim speed. I can go get it later. I'll, I'll drop the sword, draw the glaive and uh you drop start. the sword into the murky waters it will sink i know i know okay. i don't like it either um remember you can swap now and interact i have to oh draw. great let's do that oh let's, yeah that, uh, that helps sure does um then i'll i'll still have to do that with the shield Hopefully the shield is a little more buoyant if it's uh, on a water surface. Um, but yeah, I'll have to drop that and then uh, start stabbing at the one on the right. 
Yes. It is a steel shield. I don't think it floats. Yep. But you do nope. hit, and that is enough to Fantastic. skewer the Dufferex. Uh, I guess I'll keep going with the, the glaive on this one. As another hit. Nice. Although uh, that should have been a minus five. Still a hit, though. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Forgot that. All right. Slice them. All right. There we go. Now we got this. I mean, doesn't really want to have to seek a dancer, so it's gonna turn around and attack Amina. Nope. Makes way more sense come after me. Yep. Thirty-seven. Can't Thirty-six piercing. Out. It's going to grab you. Uh huh. Thirty-five versus fortitude is a success. And then it's going to eat you. Which... Uh, yeah. You will immediately take the bludgeoning and acid. Is it another check? Oh? Huh? What's this one? Um, right? Sorry, yes. There's an athletics versus your reflex. Uh -huh, uh -huh. That does not beat my reflex. Oh, it just does. No, Armina, no. It, yeah, it does. My reflexes are bad. <laughs> oh. It's okay, Armina I'm still up. Gulp I'm down. still up. Broga. This is still better than if I just tried to slash with the sword. Oh, well... Target rich environment and all that. Grankana, come out. <laughs> yeah, hey, Grankana oh, is here. <laughs> you know, he could do things that are helpful. Yeah, yeah. Dive into the murky. Uh, yeah, go to the ship. Appear <laughs> in this spot. Beat the shit out of this fish, Grankana. Uh, all right, where, where, which one? Uh, well, uh, it's bigger fish. Here, I suppose. That's uh, good. Where does right. the water start? There. Here. Yeah. You need I'll some take. line of sight, but I'll manage. Right. Uh, so that's my three actions, and he will immediately cast a spell of mirror images. <laughs> Very exciting, right. I know, but these things have opportunities, so he would die instantly trying to do anything else. Um, All right, dancer. Uh, he casts a spell, which means the fish will, uh, well, the Diffurex will it will take its attack opportunity, slapping its... 15 range? Oh, yes. God Very dang. long tentacles. Who knew? Uh, that is a... Oh, 20. That's what I'm talking about. These things are just hostile, you know? Down now, unless, unless it has multiple reactions, which I seriously doubt. That does buy us some movement to <sighs> maneuver sure. now. All right. Well, thanks to Gankano. Uh, dancer need to get Nina out, which is the fish. Uh, I am still invisible against the fish. True. Uh, you're, you're, you're hidden. Smash the fish. Yes. That's a crit. Armina, come back! <laughs> Get out of here! Uh, additional a... 2d6 for bonus damage. Um, so 8 more? Uh, 8 more, you say? Uh, two, I mean, that, that that is definitely more than the 23 slashing that is required. Uh, let's see. You do much better outside the fish. Uh, sorry, I, I believe the rupture only applies to attacks done while inside the fish. Really? Well, um, it's what? Yeah, it, it's in the context of a swallowed creature attacking. All right, well, in that case, I just have to uh, kill it then. Um. Come on. Yes. That'll do it. Oh, but didn't have your sneak attack damage. Oh. Uh, ro roll damage again. Uh, 
So it would be flat footed. Because in some weird way, Armina is still flanking. Uh, yeah, she is. Also, I'm invisible. Uh, and addi also that, that, that's additional gone. 8 damage from the precise debilitations. Alright. Or Really fish. slicing at that. I mean, third attack, right? I might as well here. Um, sure, go for it. Did I get a hit? No. Alright, no. well, we did, we did some massive ass damage on the. Dolphin. Okay. A shooting star will use cover by one degree because there's a huge amount of cover my way. Take a shot as part of it. Yeah, one degree is enough. How did that hit? Of reduction for my next turn. Dead. Amina, you are swallowed. All right, I, I don't. I definitely can't use my glaive for this, right? So, correct. I'll swap out for. Let's see, got that silver hatchet. Is that a light weapon? It is. It's, it's all right. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll swap that out. And... It does take two actions because it's in your bag of holding. Uh, is it? It is. I don't have it. No, it's in my weapons and shields section. It is now. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, I, I, I looked, see, I see. Uh, I looked in, in uh, into your inventory. Gotcha, I see, I see. All right, cool. Well, I'll just make an attack. Uh, schwack. That'll do it. Oh, 13. 13. That's, oh, but not enough. Nope. That's me. Which means at the end of your turn, mm -hmm. take 29 bludgeoning and acid. <laughs> yep, dying too. The fish will attempt to find Dancer here. That will not be enough. I mean, if it tries to swim, it'll sort of bump into him, so it it can't really... It'll try to move, bump into you, and then just attack the square you're in, uh, which does hit for a crit. I'll dodge to make it not a crit. All right. Means you take 24. That's a very low damage roll. Roger. Uh, can I target Dancer without trouble? Uh, he is well, hidden. It's a willing creature, yeah. He is, however, hidden. That you can't get around that. If you if you spend a seek action, then you could potentially spot him. Okay, but I won't be able to spot him because he's really good at hiding. All right. No, uh, no heal then, but I can just try to nuke it then. Uh, into the room, try this thing. I believe it, spirit damage is damage that does damage to things, right? It's not like yes. for the entire... Yes, if it has a soul. Uh, it... Yeah, not used to. Alright, well, I'll put it in there. 120, 20 burst. No, it should target it. Okay, he succeeds. Oh, it half. It takes half. All right. The blast it does wash over the Dufrex and does leave a significant mark between the slices that Dancer has left, uh, the spells, the arrows, the the battering from Amina from inside. It doesn't look like it can take much more. In fact, it it looks like it's trying to dive down into the depths currently and just leave. 
Well, I have to try uh, to stop it. Yeah, well, uh, Gankanak will will oh. cast uh, cast a spell on it. But no, suggestion's bad here because it's high, much higher level than him, so it, it's incapacitation, so it won't have much of an effect. Dive in, stab it. Uh, yeah, you know what? Let's go stab it. Save, mm. save Amina from horrible fate. All right, he dives in and immediately gets attack opportunity. Good. Try to hit him. Oh. Uh, that is a crit. We're gonna roll the d4 for the mirror images. It'll still be a normal success and kills an image. Takes 36. Pathetic. He says, laughing at it. Go, go, stab it. <laughs> Pathetic. <laughs> 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 Well, when it dies, it, it goes to hell. When he dies, he goes home. Okay, that's it, though. Only gets one. All right. Dance Pathetic. Up. All right. All right. Yeah, I'm flanking fish. I'm invisible. So do I need to re-hide against the fish? Or because it um, bumped into me, so I don't know exactly... I'm I'm not observed per se, right? Because he didn't spot. Me. No, you you you're not observed. You are hidden, which technically implicitly means that uh, they know which square you're in. Okay. Well, uh, regardless, we'll try to hit first, and then we'll deal with the rest later. Yes. That'll do it. And kills this differex as well. <laughs> yes, Amina can. Amina is unconscious, though. Um, I mean, Dancer will cut open the fish and drag Amina out of its guts if it has to. All right, you do that. Just try. Waiting for Amina. Stopping be yeah, sorry. before the body uh, floats to the bottom, as it attempt uh, as it seems to attempt to do. No. Oh. You cut open the guts, uh, yeah. drag out Amina, yeah. who is definitely not buoyant either. Uh, nope. uh, can I help? <laughs> you, can, you can help. Maybe he can apply some mouth to mouth to Amina. <laughs> Heard is good at that. As combat is over. Drag her to safety in the waters here. <laughs> Just see his dancer coming out. You know, this just water and blood dripping off and barely holding together. <laughs> Dragging Armina behind him, up on the ground. It's like, <gasps> oh god. <coughs> oh god, please. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm sure she starts coughing up a bunch of very unpleasant fluids. Uh... You know, uh, I feel rather sick being in here for this long. We should get out and I can take a look at the yacht there. Agreed. Agreed. Gank and I will just use his heal to action on Amina. <laughs> All right. stuff. Sheep? Yes. How heavy is your shield? Uh, well, for one, it's at the bottom of the lake right now. And two, uh, I don't want to come back and get these wheels later. Let's just do it. Yeah. How heavy is your shield? Uh... Let me see. My shield is... Doesn't say anywhere in its entry how much it weighs. Oh, bulk of one. Yeah, I can grab it. Oh, nice. Uh, do you need to be able to see it? Yeah. Well, I am targeting the object, so I assume so. Yeah, I, I think that's currently the issue. The the uh, the the waters are murky and deep. There's no way at all that I could attempt seek. Uh, sure. Give give me a seek. That makes sense. Line. Uh, no, you can roll it open. Huh. <laughs> no, you you have no idea. We can fish for it later. Uh, 
but Ganknol will. Yeah, we could do some healing. Disappear. But did you want to go outside and heal, or do you want to put this thing now? Well, the thing is, if we go out, will the fucking skeleton be like, yes, you have failed? <laughs> he might. Yeah, I, I, don't, I seriously, like, if there was anything else down but there, it would have come up by now. We will get we will get sicker and sicker staying in here, so. Well, Ten minutes is less more time fortitude talk. saves. And, uh, keep, well, let's keep. not waste any more time talking then. Armina will do the wheels first, and then she'll go down and try to get her shield. But I I swim feel... speed, she's strong. Let's just, let's just do it. Let's swim through the murky waters without yep. issue. The wheels, again, resist your turning, but not for too long. To so turn yeah. and turn and turn each one. They Small lock dive. in. The rest here. of you hear some faint movement coming from the other side of the tunnel here. Right. And the last wheel, as you turn and turn and turn, has another lock in. This one, uh, this time the mechanism reverberating slightly, and pretty much all of you immediately notice the waters arising. Uh, not by a lot, although perhaps disconcertingly fast, as the dam to the south has lowered. As the waters rise to basically about 10 feet off, not 10 feet, wait. Uh, is it 10 inches or 10 feet? That's a big difference. There is quite <laughs> a difference. Um, you looking at the diacritic and like which one's the double and which one's the single? <laughs> I always do that. Uh, several inches. Several inches. Hmm. So not enough to force you to swim, but certainly enough to make this an even more uncomfortable affair. All right, I'm going to swim down and get my shield. Is there anything else of note down there while... Uh... Uh, you take a dive, swimming among strange flora that almost seems like it both glows and also tries to grasp towards you. But mm -hmm. you're far too large to, to be a prey to those particular plants. Um, there's nothing of value down there. Mm -hmm. uh, it is also not quite as deep as it first looked like 30 feet still a significant depth but uh mm -hmm. yeah not not hundreds of feet uh takes you a little while to grab your shield but you detect nothing else of value all right i mean it's grateful for her obsidian goggles for multiple reasons now uh as she'll uh you know her her feet on the ground and push up and shoot back up Ugh. Okay, now we don't have to come back here. So should we do horrible place? Do one ward medic thing just to get us out of yeah. the most critical before we proceed. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. All right, one water bandage. Huh. There you go, guys. Right. Yep. Healthy 33 here. Right, well, next encounter, I suppose. Actually, I can do a little bit better than that um, by just using heal a big bit. I have, I have give some. Me, give me another set of fortitude saves for all of those who don't have a bottle of air. Yeah, you're fine. Uh, that is a fail, but not a crit fail. And Tolfin is also not a crit fail. I'm basically just looking for crit fails for the two of you. We're going to have 11 more. Thank you. Right. That should do. Nice. Until you go until I pass out from vomiting or something. Hold okay. out. So is it lowered out here so we can pass through? 
the pipes still seem to be closed at the other end here. No, I mean the the dam. Uh, the the dam to the south, however, yes, it is in fact now lowered and open. Uh, how do I how how do I open it? Help. That good? No. Um. That do it? No. Why is it still blocking? Yeah, Hello. Don't. Oh, cause there's a door on top of a door. I see. That makes sense. Huh. There you go. Hmm? The dam has lowered, revealing another reasonably large chamber behind it. A river of water flying, uh, flowing through an artificial can canal. Ah, it's our friend, this... Grand Canal. <laughs> <laughs> it's a circular pool of swamp water. We finally, at the we finally got him home. Given, given the condition of everyone, Corporal, we'll check it out. For you. All right. Yeah. As you approach, yeah, you're looking at this. You do think that you should keep your distance from the writhing, uh, the writhing reeds in the center of this pool. Okay. Uh, like... Yeah, you think as long as you don't touch the the flora, you should be okay. Away from the plants. Face Yeah, air in here better. Yes, the air in here does seem significantly better. Oh, all right, huddle in the corner. Heal up. Touch the reeds. I guess I can search. I don't need healing. Oh. So, I don't like. We can find a corner where we can heal up. Shouldn't move until that's done. <laughs> Focus. Yeah, it can be fun. It's a nice corner over here. Looks pretty safe. So you're really going to the furthest corner of this death room? It's furthest away from the doors and the weird... I feel like in this corner we have a good view of everything. There's plants between us and everyone else. And... Oh, God. Uh, what have sorry. you done, you fool? Sorry. Help, sheep. I ran into the wall. <laughs> you did. <laughs> All right. Okay. Can I so can the... I go vomit sheep? Can I can I just go to the water yes. section and just puke? Don't touch the reeds. Well. Then I will. You, you you vomit into the waters. <laughs> give give me D twenty. Yeah. Like I. <laughs> well, what you, on the floor where we're gonna be staying yeah, for like an hour? Yeah, doesn't matter. After <laughs> Torfin said, do not disturb the plants of this death room. Plants. <laughs> it, there's plants right there. It's right in front of you. Your vomit is sh like covering them. Oh my god. Uh, well, that'll teach well, you. The, the waters flow tranquil. The plants, as you know, there there is something familiar about reeds and vines and such uh, growing out of a a pond of stagnant swamp water but there's also something distinctly alien about these they move in ways that suggest that there might be wind maybe but that doesn't make sense no you all gonna be happy i did that so you don't accidentally put these needles in your eyeballs or something so orphan also Ooh. vomits oh do i have to oh yeah. i puke it it's it's never leaves your body unless, sure. unless you actively. All right, you just 
Whatever. Puke leaves into a corner. <laughs> oh. so, so are the uh, the swaying yeah. mysterious reeds whispering to Torfin, perhaps? Uh, these the... ones are not. No. Whispering reeds. The whispers in the reeds. Hmm. Uh, there, oh. there. He he does, however, feel a distinct vibration coming from the uh, his tome. Sure. The vibrating one, reeds. <laughs> what could go wrong? Uh, one that has intensified uh, since you entered this room, perhaps, or presumably uh, since you opened the dam and technically succeeded at the first challenge. What do you mean technically? <laughs> what does the book say? Uh, the book doesn't seem to say anything. It's just that there's a distinct presence attached to it. Okay. Red foreboding. Yeah, you could you could say that. Want to heal? I mean, if you want, but uh... Uh, you could give me an occultism check. Hold the reeds. Can I use the book. Give me a bonus for the book. <laughs> sure, that makes sense. <laughs> That's two. Oh, sorry, I meant to blind that. Yeah, roll it again, but blind. Yeah. You have a feeling that it is a sign of attention. Not fully on you, but it's like the the moment before uh, the moment after you wave towards a friend and you aren't entirely sure if he's seen you, but there, there's like this this moment before he looks at you. That, that's sort of the feeling. Okay. Oh god, did I just wave to a stranger? The awkward walking down the corridor and you have spotted a co-worker far ahead, but you can't really wave because it's too far ahead. You need to pretend <laughs> you haven't seen each other until you're closer and then look up at the same time. Mm. I mean, there's no awkwardness attached to it. It's like the the moment before someone else locks eyes with you. Mm. Oh, Fred. <laughs> <laughs> That's like millennial right there. <laughs> oh, Eye contact, terrifying. Oh, no. <laughs> well, the the yep. eyes are the windows to the soul. You don't want people staring into that. You know. Mm -hmm. All right, you take 10 minutes to heal up. You do some more. Um, okay. right, that's an activity you can do quietly, I think. I mean, I forgot to heal. No, I, I did it. She just needs more. Yeah. Oh, we can take another 10 minutes. If yes, you... yes, yes. Keep, keep pumping us. comfortable with the whispering. Peaceful, actually. Yeah, like sink, listening to it in my sink, sleep. Sink beneath yeah, the waters. Record it. Go backwards. Oh, yeah. The voice. ASMR. Ooh. The whispering reads. Have, have more of this, you do. Thank you. So many fish bites. All right. That's pretty good. There's a lot of fish bites. Well, I mean, we could take 10 more minutes if you want more. You're wounded. All right, but then I mm. want a d20 from you, though. 18 more. Okay. Basically free. And I'll roll d20, sure. The three. Uh, you begin your session here. Uh, as you do, however, notice that the uh, reeds in the center have gone strangely silent for a moment, really. The, the movement is gone. Um, but then you are interrupted. Something jumps out of them. What the heck? A, ah. a slug-like, many-eyed creature suddenly screeches, uh, bursting out of the reeds to Ooh. attack you. 
Yes. Yeah. The reed portal. Uh, oh. Kill it. it. It certainly seems like it wants to kill you. Tenso, I think yeah. you should deal with this. You yeah. need to deal with this. What, Everybody add. Just finished fixing circumstance you up, and now this bonus. thing's going to ruin it. Uh, okay. Torfin, you can give me uh, your recall knowledge right away. Cultism. It is another obviously aberration creature. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, but you have no idea what this one is. Actually succeeded. <laughs> uh, Amina, you get to act first. Okay, I've actually successfully frightened the thing. Uh, 30? Yeah. You, you sure was frightened? Yes. Yes. Uh, I don't particularly fancy going in there. Um, do those tentacles look like they have a lot of uh, reach to them? They look pretty long. Um, uh, fairly long. Hmm. Fairly long, you say. Uh, I think... Yeah, I think I'm just gonna switch, like, pick up my glaive and ready an attack when it comes within range. Alright. I want to touch that, that crap. Ready an attack, Roger. Yeah, I mean, mean bad monster. That but it's alive, that... I presume. Yes. So uh, it could be stuffed. He gets to do a fortitude save. It succeeds, but it is sickened. Right. And Amina, have a battlefield medicine. Because, you know, oh, now we're not. Now, now we're just going to hurry up to finish this. There you go. Thank you. And that's the reactions. All right. The creature will cast a. Spell. Yeah, he's a ranged creature. Oh, so that's cool. Oh, good. Um. Yeah, as it will cast tangling creepers, making more wreaths and other alien plants sprout out in pretty much the entire room. As it is now all suddenly covered in witching creepers. Uh, any creature moving on the land or climbing or swimming within the creepers takes minus 10 foot circumstance penalty to its speeds while in the area. Once per round, uh, the plants will also lash out from any square within the creepers. Uh, well, he can make them lash out by spending an action. Uh, if the attack succeeds, the vine pulls the target into the creepers and makes it immobilized for one round. Dancer. Okay. Uh, I need to close to the thing then. Uh, 35 up here. Alright. Target. Um, well, he's not of guard. To remedy first, faint him. It goes the creature with the weird eyes. Yeah, looking closer, it almost looks like a mass of like larvae just sort of bunched together into a strange single host. Oh, good. Uh, 35. Yeah, that, that's enough. Great. Or not a crit, though. Not a crit, no. Uh, then we... Seven, and I will make it off guard. As the 
Teleportation. All right. Uh, it does seem to be uh, pretty heavily resistant to fire. Okay. Often. Okay. A short strike. Um, okay. Off. Great. That is a crit. Oh. Double this. All right. Double the bleed. Yep. Hey. It is bleeding. A massive strike. You like rip apart some of its skin and see that it, it's basically just packed full of individual smaller worm-like creatures. Amina. Okay. I'll uh, move up and stab. Alright, you jump into the water. Yeah, I'd prefer not to. If I, uh, how are. Alright, the diagonals are 15 feet. Yeah, there's nothing I can do. Okay. Uh, go and stab. Yeah, the, the pool of water you're currently in is just a few inches deep, so it, it doesn't really... It's mm. difficult terrain, but, I mean, everything is going to take. I'll hear a point that second one. 18 damage on the uh, first one. That's a nat 20. That is a nat 20. So I slice and another massive slice. Yep. And first action was moved, so that's me. All right, Roga. Oh, I mean, this thing's turning out not to be as bad as the other ones. Uh, I'm just going to try to cast Daze on it. See if that does mm. anything. All right. It succeeds. Mm -hmm. Well, it takes half of that. Uh, actually, sorry, it takes nothing. You try to target a single mind, but there's so many. Targeting a single one of them doesn't do anything. All right. Well, I guess that's something. Some sort of multi, multi creature. Yes. Move here, and then uh, that's my turn. All right. It is a swarm mind. Uh, it on its turn will. Uh, what weapon is Amina currently like? Obviously wielding a glaive. All right. It's also looking at Delta right next to him. Uh, it will. Hmm. It will take a step back, and cast. Control water, it's raising the level that it's on right now. Will uh, or stepped. Right. He steps. Oh, he can't no, he he is. It, it is considered swampy terrain. It is difficult terrain, but he is not affected. At land. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Uh, well, it won't be uh, land for long because control water. The oh. entire room very quickly fills up with uh, 10 feet of water. Pr practically Ooh. means all of you are swimming, uh, including the creature itself. However, it seems to uh, be moving around just fine. Mm. Uh, Amina has a swim speed. I Do you still have a swim she speed? She sure does. Yeah. All right. The rest of you while in the water, however, are guard. Dancer, you're swimming. There's also underwater creepers just below you. You won't be affected by the uh, speed reduction from them anymore, but they can still. Uh, uh, the creature can still use them to attack you. Sure. Uh, well, I will then swim. Here? Uh, actually, apologies. It does specifically say that swimming in the area um, still means you take the penalty. But you probably have enough speed to get there, right? I have 35. So I think I can move two squares. Right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Creepy creepers are creeping. Uh, so is Dancer. So peek up through here. And... He'll glare angrily at it. Uh... 
for a while. Yeah, well. Completely immune, and I cannot attempt for another week or whatever it is, I think. If I push that. Okay. Um, alright, well, that didn't work. Couldn't really see him. Uh, so let's uh, just smash him. No. I roll back. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. My my hero point rerolls are not uh, not uh, giving me much session. Uh, that is then I paired and right off it. Oh, underwater work with my shooting. Uh, ice. well, currently everything has basically happened like on the surface of the water. You're just all swimming, uh, which means currently it wouldn't affect you. Okay. Art uh, has cover. Okay. Uh, is it still flat footed? I don't think so because Dancer didn't hit. That is a good hit, yeah. Uh, still bleeding, or? Yes. Take this. Did it take the bleed damage? Don't recall. Uh, no, I forgot to take the bleed damage, so I'm gonna do that now. Cover no. And uh, twenty-eight. Yeah, it is. And it is looking uh, torn apart, pretty much. Yes. Okay. Amina. Okay. Move over. Here's my last terror point. Hey. That is it. Twenty. And then we'll try again. No. Roga. Well, none of my damaging spells work. No one's particularly hurt. Um, so, uh, another creature that isn't undead, evil, or, uh, I guess, singular. I'll, uh, I guess I'll redraw my rapier. Can make my way over here. Get to there. I move for the horrid vines and trying to drag myself through them. Got another action. I could step near, like adjacent to it, uh, but it's it's turn next, so I'm not going to. Right. All yeah. right. It'll be his turn. Um, basically, all of you except Dolphin from the distance there can see that the creature is rapidly knitting itself back together. Like the these slashes and such you you're inflicting in the, in its skin, don't seem to stick very well. As it will then uh, turn its weird, like lava filled head towards uh, Dancer and Roga here, and suddenly shoots many of these lava towards you in a big cone. Mm. Uh, give me reflex saves. Not a big fan of that. Uh, Dancer dodges. Uh, Roga fails, not a crit fail. I could probably do that better, um, right? That's still a failure. You take 45 piercing damage. Oh. And a fortitude save, please, as the uh, larvae try to try to burrow into you, but you you don't you don't care. They get drunk just, on my alcoholic blood and die off. <laughs> just die off immediately. Too young to have livers. And then, uh, with its last action, it's gonna... 
Um, have one of the creepers attack? Uh, probably, probably Roga over there. Uh, which will be a melee spell attack. Which I'm not sure how I can actually roll that. But I have the bonus, so I'm just going to roll it manually. 31 versus AC. Against me? Yes. It's a hit. Alright, which means you are dragged to uh, the floor, which means 10 feet underwater. Uh, and Ooh. immobilized for one round. Ooh. Ooh. Answer. Okay. Uh, well, uh, we need to flash at the creature. Maybe someone who knows something can see if they can recognize if he has any weaknesses. Um, so we can I stop failed. the region. Sorry. Well, you can try again, right? Uh, nevertheless, attack. He's off guard. Flanking and. Whoa. Yes. That is a head. Twenty-two. I will make him off guard, orphan. Okay. As you slash at him, however, you still see the the various writhing larvae, the skin knitting back together. It's not going to stay dead for long. Okay. Um. I guess I will. Uh, I guess I will use an acid flask on it to see if that stops the region. Yeah, you. You chuck acid, acid yeah. uh, at it. Uh, it sizzles in the water, but it doesn't really affect the creature more or less than you would expect. Okay, maybe we need like a holy damage or something. Um, if it ain't fire and ain't acid, I can't do much <laughs> else in that department. I am done. I top it. Alright, recall knowledge. Is it okay. not? Give me another occultism. Or an applicable law skill if you have one of those. Astrology? <laughs> okay. Um, no. Yeah. Um, you aren't entirely sure, but you haven't. You, you know it's resistant to fire. You've seen that from Dance's weapon. Uh, you would guess maybe. Electricity or cold? You haven't tried those yet. Okay. Well, any compressions or frost? Oh shit! Right dead. You blasted with your magic arrow. Roll me some damage. Yep. Add frost onto it. And as it turns out, the frost freezing its weird skin, making it uh, impossible for the larvae to, to form another coherent body. As the, the, the shell just crumbles into nothingness. Uh, the individual bits of the creature seem to flee back into the into the uh, plants here. You're pretty sure, certain that destroying them fully is going to be a, a monumental and tedious task. Um, but it is unlikely that this creature can reform any time in the near future. Great. Is the final form of Red Pants Man, do you think? <laughs> there, there, there was no, there was no similarity. Just that they are both sort of hive mind creatures. Red pants, liver. Oh, they're definitely the same. <laughs> yeah. The water slowly lowers again. Out of the reeds. Nice. Rogar. Yeah, let's pull Rogar out of there. <laughs> Under the water. Start hacking away with the Can you stand up, Roger? Can you stand up? It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I actually can't, though. <laughs> I'm 
under what, the floor. What, whatever's under the map. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh, Where did you go? Is Midas dead? He's under the floor. Send of minus me down. Me down, me down below. <laughs> I don't even see him anymore. No. He's, he's over he's here. here. He's just invisible. Oh, there he is. Under the I'm floor. I'm in the walls. <laughs> Put him under the floor. There you go. Yeah. There you go. There we go. Ooh. Start breaking oh, the floor. Else, Can I get it? Oh, the back rooms of this place. <laughs> oh. Oh, let's get out of here. Yes. Skeleton has some answering to do. <laughs> Open the door. All right. You open the door. Give me just a second to get a drink. Let's take a fucking break. Okay. All right. Although, looking at the time, Valky, do you have to leave early? I have work. Yep. Hmm. Oh, All right, really? then, then never mind the break. All right. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, as you know, no, no, no. Fine, man, can I can pee in the bottle. <laughs> as with a, with a mighty push, you open the southern door. It grinds open as if it hasn't been opened in a while. Oh. And what you see is the familiar sight of the skeleton. Uh... A look of disdain on her skeletal face as you make your way through the door. She says, I know that you are pretenders. You have no interest of passing the trials to worship Nimbaloth, to become a disciple. It's that much you've stated as much. And yet... She thinks you serve some purpose to her plans. Do you know how many millennia I've begged and prayed and hoped and wished to even get an ounce of attention of her after she has punished me so, after I've served her with every ounce of my being, after I've guided so many to see her light, her darkness, and everything in between? And yet, I've not, I've not even been given a hint that she still knows of my existence. I've not been gifted the end that I require. And yet, here you are, walking in here, and immediately I feel the head turn. Why is that? I guess you to, suck. I'm sorry. <laughs> to give you the end you're looking for, perhaps? Seems like that's, a that's really very rude. I mean, it's, it's 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 her problem. It's her problem. I feel I did, like we can't take responsibility for her shitty god paying attention to her. I mean, uh, I suppose no it is true, but the thing is, there are other gods out there and... those other gods you speak of <laughs> mm -hmm. it is compared your worship of those gods is comparable to a beggar approaching a king asking for arms she however is something so different alien it is more like a mosquito trying to get but a simple drop of invigorating blood from an elephant, a creature larger, large enough to not even notice your existence. And if it does, it will not treat you kindly. Well, that is the relationship that Nimbaloth offers. A, even a glimpse of her may give you the things you desire. And more beyond that, beyond even your own comprehension, or it may simply be a slap that is extinguishes you so thoroughly. Nothing you have done up until this point will have mattered. I would interrupt your soliloquy here, Lady Skeleton. But we have reached the final stage. I believe you promised help and assistance. I have promised nothing. In oh. fact, I will make my first promise now. I do not know what plans you supposedly may serve her in, but I disagree. It is my position as 
It's the guide for those who wish to meet her, to weed out the weak. And no matter what the challenges suggest, you are not worthy. As will and initiative. Rex Knuckles. Ah, faith changing the rules as soon as their terms That's don't lead to the desire the that they predetermined. What else is new? And uh, looking at the time, I think we will pick up in this battle next time. The gauntlet continuing after a harrowing mm -hmm. battle against some of the uh, most deadly uh, denizens yeah. of Nimbalov's old home, Voidbracken. Oh. Yeah. You live one more week, weird chair skeleton. <laughs> I still, you know, I sometimes the unexpected is cool. Like, it would be cool if the chair is actually the creature. Mm -hmm. Like, the skeleton is <laughs> just like the dead body that mm -hmm. sits upon it because they died on there, that, you know? That's what I asked if the chair was like moving with mm -hmm. the skeleton on it, like floating around. Yeah. yeah. No, sadly. Because <laughs> that would be a pretty cool. Be yeah. yeah. Mm. You sit in it, it drains your life force or something. Mm -hmm. Right, wait, I, I have music for her. Ooh. I have a lot of valuables on her. <laughs> I mean, that's true. A lot of jade. Or, or copper, I guess, could be. Also, like, facing through the ship. Mm. Ah! ah! Oh, oh, God! So scary. Love it. Very dramatic music that we will get to enjoy <laughs> at length, I'm sure, next time. <laughs> That's good. Very Castlevania. Ba -ba -ba uh, speaking of next time, uh, we did have a brief discussion about potentially maybe squeezing in an extra session if we're close to the end. Uh -huh. Um... We are certainly reasonably close. I, I can't give you an exact yes, next session is going to be end. Next session is not going to be the end. I, I, I can assure you of that much. Um, but maybe two seems like or we three still sessions. Have a, seems like we still have a fair bit to do. Yeah, I think the, the previous level is like almost completely unexplored. I think we got most uh, of the last level. We, we just we didn't kill all of the Odetheas. This is going to be like four sessions. The Death it, King, it the certainly, Dragon... Of it certainly Korea. depends on uh, how thorough you are, how lucky you are, how uh, where you choose to go. But it is certainly something where I'm saying like it's possible that we can conclude this campaign before your vacation if we wanted to try to push for that. Right. Yeah. Yeah. But we also don't have to force anything. Like there, oh. there's certainly plenty, plenty enough to do still. I um. I will remind everyone that we are not here next week. Because mm -hmm. it is midsummer. We are off for a barbecue mm -hmm. party. Yes. You know what? Let, let's let's not push it then. Let's see how long this takes. There's no need no need to rush. Mm -hmm. My guess is eight sessions or more. <laughs> just knowing from pre mm -hmm. like, you know, it's to, kind of the be fair, then... to be fair in, in uh Odyssey of the Dragonauts, there was a point where, where I was like, ah, we'll probably be finished in like four sessions. And then we played for four more months. Like half a year. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, it's fine. I, we don't need to force it. Uh, as I said, I don't, um, I don't mind uh, playing more of this during my vacation, I think. Like, we'll see. There might be some Friday I skip out because, you know, I want to do something else. On vacation, uh, but we are in a situation where, where, also the week after that, we're not here either because Dawn Trail releases. Oh right, yeah. So so, there is a two week gap now, um, that I would say that I am willing to try to jiggle in a session either on, I'll well, say, you know, Saturday or. Some other day of the week that might work for people. 
like a Wednesday or something. I don't know. Tuesday. Yeah, I, I would certainly like to have the keep the momentum going. If we can do like one session a week still, then at least it's not like we're here in a month and everyone's like, who's this guy? Yes. <laughs> yes. So yeah, I, was, I was just wondering, yeah. do we even have a Saturday campaign I just, on the server? I, I just right can't do weekdays still. Hmm. I mean, the, the only viable option I can see is Saturday at some point, um, probably evenings. Like, would that at least be an option to yeah. consider? Yes. It could be. Yeah. Again, yeah. I think I'm the most flexible of, of because the evenings for you guys is like mornings for me, so there's like no conflict. I, I can do the 22nd, which is next Saturday, but again, the 29th on the week after that whole weekend is going to be just be yeah. marathon gaming for Dawn Trail. So I'm, I'm if gonna... if there's anyone who understands the need for a marathon session yeah. when a new expansion releases, it is me. Yeah. Don't don't you worry. <laughs> yeah. So I, I would suggest we aim to play next week Saturday then. Yes. Yeah. Um skip the week after and just discuss to see how the week after looks, like we will stay flexible then. Yeah, at that point I'm I'm in my vacation day, so if if we, we really were, we could be like, Alright, slam this out. A session a day, three days straight, let's do it. Like we could just yeah, I, charge it, yeah. like if that's what people want. Yeah, I, uh, I can't. I don't think that's uh, plausible, sadly. Uh, I I can. Uh, I work. Yeah. yeah. I basically get vacation when I'm leaving for Sweden, and then I go back to work when I come home. Sure. So, so next next Saturday, and then a break for that week, and then on the fifth we would reconvene potentially. Yeah, we can at least like you know, crank out this boss fight and have like a nice ending before taking a little break. Oh, you, you think this is a boss fight? <laughs> I don't know, the music kind of tells me. You got a unique <laughs> track for this uh, for this fight. I'm going to guess that it's a boss uh, fight. <laughs> we'll see what type of boss fight it is. If it is giant spider, big fish danger, or if it is devil getting critted twice and dying uh, situation. Mm. I, I have I have right. one reasonably leveled heal spell left. Right. One heal spell left. Yeah, uh, a couple of the first level ones, you know. But, uh, uh -huh. but it's it, ideally it would be one of the you know, end it end it quick. Yeah. We had to go for a lot. You guys got hurt a lot. And, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Fine, I can uh, I can cross out the feather token swan boat and crush her. <laughs> a thirty six square boat will you smash on top of her? Sure, let's go do something. <laughs> Lands uh. there. Her jaws extend as he devours oh, she the whole thing. Wanted to go out in a bang, you know. Just incredible how none of these guys, you know are into being converted to a religion that makes more sense. Yeah. <laughs> Gonna roll all the initiative. So again, maybe if I was the one surrounded by wisps all the time, I wouldn't be too keen on pissing them off either. Yeah. All right. We uh, are yeah. for next time. So I, I wrote our oh my goodness into the group chat. I'm just going to pin them. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I forgot to target. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, we might level again before this is over. Hmm. At this pace, yeah. What's the XP? Yeah. I, I will tell you, if you reach level 11, you will stop gaining experience, because otherwise it's going to mess with whatever campaign I do after, where you might want to keep using those characters. What? Okay. Well, at that point, then, the your speed finishes, no point. Yeah, it's like, oh. <laughs> but, uh, that you got to keep your friend. <laughs> Any RPG when you reach the final yeah, yeah. boss, and suddenly those people are like, please, sir, I need your help. You're like, ah, you know what? Whatever. Yeah, I'm, I'm busy. You can, yeah. you can rest on it. This whole city, yeah. <laughs> what do I get for nothing? Uh, uh you, you figure that out. You get, to, well, I mean, honestly, mm -hmm. it's always you get to do it. You get to an, an excuse to kill things, which will teach you how to fight better. Yeah. Okay. It usually works. Hmm. We get the warm, fuzzy feeling of having to done insignificant good that will not matter. 
Mm, okay. Yeah. Well, Saturday it is.